Hi everyone, welcome to Nomad Sea Kayaking, another one of our videos, the beginning of the season for 2022. It's been a while and so uh, this video is long overdue. Welcome again, good to see you all and um, uh, really a short video just to celebrate 17 years in business. 17 years, so we celebrated our anniversary a uh, day before yesterday uh, on the 5th, uh, so the 5th of April 2005, the company Nomad Ventures was incorporated. First two years, we did extreme sports, so we're doing things like paragliding and base jumping, shooting, obstacle courses, uh, outdoor adventure in France in a fort up in the French Alps. And we did that for a couple of years and then there was demand for the kayaking and so that's what we did. So one of the things I want to talk about here, the, the, the cost of fuel that's been going up and it has a huge effect on us as a business um, and I just wanted to uh, I want you to all understand what the implications are if there are any for customers and for members First thing is the this price of, uh, of fuel we all know the price has gone up dramatically and for us as a business we're not on electric yet we are trying to get onto electric but there's nothing available in the UK that can give us the mileage that we need the the range uh, and with a big trailer on the back full of kayaks. At the moment, we're still pulling our um, big trailer, all of the trailers, there's three trailers, uh, with a 2.5 turbo diesel. It's an old vehicle, but it's been well cared for. It's on its last legs, uh, but needless to say, the consumption is high. That aside, the price of fuel is extraordinary at the moment. And, you know, we uh, two days ago, we filled up. It cost £103 to fill up. 103 pounds and that will go really quickly particularly when we're driving from northeast Suffolk all the way to places like Brightlingsea and Harwich in a different county in Essex pulling a big trailer with 12 to 15 16 kayaks on at a time um, and so that has an effect on the business so what we're doing um, is for every single event courses and um, trips we have all of the dates have been published and they were published last year for this year and for next year 2023 they're all on the website what we've done and what we've had to do is um, put all of those dates offline barring the first date so any event that you go on now um, you will see that there's just one date and that's the next available date so for for memory if i look at the introduction to sea kayaking level one course the next available date is in June and only that date will be showing. There are dates for July, August and so on all the way through the year. They are available, they are online, but they won't be available to you until we fill that first date. Simple reason for that is because we can't have um, multiple dates on each event and only have it half booked. Um, we need to fill each event. We're better off having less events but having those events fully booked than having lots of events half booked. And that just, that's just common sense. That makes sense. So those dates are still there and they will be opened up as and when. So as soon as we have enough people on the first date to, for that event to go ahead, then um, the next date will be opened up. So for example, let's look at the introduction to sea kayaking course as an example, level one. If you, the next available date is in June. If you want to July, you can get July. You just have to wait. You have to sit tight, wait for our email to come, our latest updates email. And when that comes and you see the dates open, go straight onto the website and book the date. If you don't want our emails, um, no problem. Just unsubscribe. Click, click, click. Job done. Hey, just give us a shout. You know where we are. Um, we're always happy to hear from you. We will see you guys on the water soon. No matter out.